Talk a little about the experience editing advances in biology and management in bed bugs. What inspired the compilation of this book, the first comprehensive scholarly treatment of bed bugs since 1966? The last great academic work on bed bugs was by Robert Singer in 1966. While this text was largely taxonomic in nature, there are chapters on bed bug biology, management, amongst others. However, much of the information on the management is of course no longer relevant today as insecticides used then are just no longer available, such as DDT. Following the modern bed bug resurgence, which really began in the late 90s, there's been a huge renewed interest in bed bug research in the field. For example, over the years 2000 2016, there were almost 500 bed bug publications in scientific journals. And we could really multiply this by 10 if we added all the papers that appeared in industry journals. For some years, really, which with this idea started around 2010, I've been thinking that we need a new textbook on bed bugs that assimilated all the past information with all this contemporary information that's just appearing in the scientific literature. In fact, I just simply could not believe that nobody had decided to do this or acted on it. So I decided to do something about it. Previously, I mentioned about two important people who were sitting in my talk way back in 2004. These were Professor Dinny Miller from, the, from Virginia Tech in the US and Professor Chao Yang Lee from the University of Sains, Malaysia, obviously in Malaysia. I was officially introduced to this wonderful duo um, in the late noughties. I, I was introduced to Dinny back in 2007 at the Entomological Society of America when I was asked to speak, and Chao Yang Li I met around 2010. And I basically developed an interesting report with both. At the International Congress of Entomology in 2014, which was held at Zurich in Switzerland, I decided to do something about the idea of this bedbug book. So I approached both at the conference idea with the idea of the book, and surprisingly, they quickly agreed. Sorry. I would like to blame the alcohol for assenting to the daunting task ahead, but Dini does not drink. The next step was to put a proposal together and send it off to a book publisher. And we selected Wiley Blackwell for various reasons. The rest is now history, but the process took some four years from concept to publication.